Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to talk about a few of the ways that I have been mixing up my wardrobe lately. Very recently I've sort of felt like I was in a little bit of a star rut so I kind of wanted to dabble in a few trends and just try out a few new things while still staying very true to I guess the core principles and foundations of my wardrobe. So today's video is in collaboration with Astrid and Miu which is a London based jewellery brand. They ship internationally and they have a really beautiful selection of more minimal style pieces they are edgy they do have a little bit of a twist but they are definitely great go-to's particularly if you like to keep things very simple so I grabbed a few things and I think probably the most fun thing that I think I got was the evil air cuff so I'm wearing this today just with some pearl earrings to kind of I think elevate it and notch and I love the fact that I don't need to have any other studs or anything any other piercings in my ear to be able to wear this so this is in the silver and it has little diamantes around the rim of the actual earring and then it also has a blue diamante in the center where the eye is which I love I think it is such a subtle but beautiful touch and they actually do chokers and rings as well in the range which I'll link down below because I think they're really cool I was eyeing up the ring um, then I also went for a choker and I haven't really gotten into chokers too much and I thought it would just be really fun to try one out because they have definitely been all the rage I grabbed this suede tie choker so this basically wraps around your neck like this and then you have the sort of lariat style hanging down the center here um, I'll show you guys in the cutaway just how this looks on but I really like this and I think it looks gorgeous with a white shirt just unbuttoned and then you've got the lariat detail down the center I think it's so sexy and then I went for a couple of pieces which are a little bit more classic so I really really love stacking rings and it's just something that I haven't been able to do too much because I haven't had rings at all are sort of the same size so I went for a whole bunch from Astrid and me and I grabbed the Aries ring the Gemini ring and also the court in the middle ring which is this one down the bottom and I love the way that these look so these are essentially a claw style ring so you can adjust the size which I love because I never know which size to buy online and I like the combination of them how you can kind of twist them around because they do have that opening and I just think it's a really cool stack and then I also went for the fine lines bangle so this is sort of part of their more premium range and I'm wearing it on my wrist today this is in the white gold version and it's basically a fine thin silver bangle and it has a chain here where the opening is so that kind of hangs down both ways I'll show you guys again in the cutaways just so you can get a bit of a closer look I've absolutely been loving wearing these pieces and I just think that they are such a nice touch and just something a little bit different and it makes me feel excited getting ready in the morning so next I wanted to talk about shoes and slides have been having a huge moment recently and I have just been all over it I've got about 10 pairs of slides and mules in my wardrobe I've gone a bit overboard because when it comes to shoes I really don't know how to stop myself so I've got a few pairs that I think are probably my favorites in terms of flat and then heels and I really wanted to share them with you so the first pair are these black leather slides from ASOS these are super affordable and I love the way that these look they are so comfortable the leather is just really soft so it means that you don't have to break them in which I absolutely love and then the other pair that I wanted to mention now these were a bargain find from the real real and you guys know how much I love shopping on there so these are from Celine and they are a kind of an a khaki olive leather with a silver heel and they have this really interesting cutout detail on the toe which I really like it's just so different and I think that these look great with some white denim they look great with dresses I am just so pleased to pick these up because I actually had a pair of shoes from this collection that I bought in Paris and they were the most uncomfortable shoes I have ever owned everybody was all about them I can't remember what they were called but I'll try and set a little photo but these on the other hand are just so comfy and I love the heel I think it's a statement and yeah they're definitely just a great everyday go-to shoe for when you want to feel a little bit fancy then I had a third pair of shoes sorry I told you guys I'm shoe crazy um, and these are the glove shoes I've noticed that 
there are a lot of brands out there that are doing them and the ones that I've been loving so much lately have been from Everlane. So these are the black day shoe and they have that elasticated back. These are super soft leather. They are so comfortable. And I actually also picked these up in the nude because I just love the way that these look and I've gotten so many compliments on them. So yeah, I do love this and I just think that it's a great way to elevate the look, but it's still very comfy, easy, just a go-to shoe. Now I think probably the biggest way that I've been trying to mix up my wardrobe has been with silhouettes because I feel like that is where you can make the biggest change and really feel that impact of how you are mixing things up and doing things a little bit differently. And I have to say probably my favorite, favorite piece in my wardrobe at the moment has to be this top from Susan. So it's a pretty simple top, you know, it's just loose throughout the body, but then it has the most stunning ruffle fluted sleeves. I just love this. It has so much movement and it looks good with absolutely everything. And of course the polka dots are just so playful and fun. I actually have a really gorgeous knit top from Lonely which has flared sleeves. Again, just kind of really going for it for that trend, but just while keeping it really muted and neutral so that it works with the rest of my wardrobe. And then the other thing that I've been doing a lot, so I just got everything hanging on my chair, it has been wearing trousers. Now I have been so into pants lately. I never used to be. I'm really trying to start getting into wearing jeans a bit more on the weekend. I mean, we do have a dog, so you know, it's a lot more practical, but I've been really getting into trousers of all sorts. And I think my favorite has to be the culotte. So these ones here are from ASOS. They're a pink linen culotte. So they have a great kind of big flared uh, trouser. But I just think these look so flattering. They are so easy to wear as well. They look perfect just with a simple t-shirt or with a little cami tucked in. That's probably one of my favorite ways to wear them just with maybe a shoe like the day heel that I mentioned earlier. But I just adore these and I love the color and this is just a nod to that pink trend as well. Lastly, I've been really getting into slogan tees and just trying to incorporate them into my wardrobe a little bit more, maybe with a little bandana because I think that it helps to dress it up a little bit. And I've got two here that I will have been wearing a bit lately. So I've got this one here from Stussy. So was it Stussy? Stussy. Um, this is really, really simple and plain. It basically just has the brand name and across the center and it's got a bit of embroidery and I think that this is really cute it's super boxy but it's great for the weekend and I just love how it looks paired with a little leather skirt and then the other one you guys have seen a million times because I'm pretty sure I feature it in all my lookbooks but it is my it's lit t-shirt from Brandy Melville this one comes out all the time and I think because it is white and it's just so simple works with everything and again it just looks amazing with a necktie but I also think it would look really incredible with that Thai choker from Astrid and Me that I mentioned before. I just think that would be a really cute look. So those are the four ways that I have been mixing up my wardrobe recently. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was a little bit of a new in as well as me just chatting through the things that I have been loving and really getting into as of late. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and also to Astrid and Me for partnering with me on this video. I will see you next time with a brand new one. See you later. Bye!